Hi guys, a huge hug and welcome to my channel. So today we are going to look at how to look elegant and expensive using the items you already have in your closet. Let's do this. I think one of my most important tips is to never look like your problems. Handle them in the background so that you could look elegant and classy. Big kudos to a TikToker that I follow for sharing this very important tip. One of my first tips on being elegant and looking expensive is to be regal. And by that I mean poised. It doesn't mean that you walk around like the queen with your nose stuck in, up in the air as if you're better than the next person. No, it just means to carry yourself well, sit well, walk well, and you would look classy, elegant, and sophisticated. And while this outfit is not the best, sitting erect and with dignity are important aspects of self-management. Believe it or not, looking expensive also means how you manage yourself. And by that I mean how you manage your attitude and the perception that you put out there. The second tip is to get your monochrome on. As mentioned in a previous video, a monochromatic look is a no-brainer. It's one of the quickest and simplest, I would say, ways of looking elegant, chic, and expensive. Yeah, over the years I've put together several looks that really, really make me look expensive, despite the fact that these pieces, they weren't expensive at all. So here are a few for you. Sorry to interrupt guys, but just a quick note. Hi guys! If you just so happen to just click on my video, you are new, please click the red subscribe button. So here they are guys, if you click on these buttons, you'll be part of my channel and you'll be notified when I post new videos. And most importantly guys, it's free! Thank you so much for subscribing. Love ya. Let's get back to the video. As you are aware, fabric fit and style is my current mantra. And this piece I absolutely love because it makes me look expensive. And as I've said before, it doesn't take a lot for you to follow this mantra. I have incorporated this mantra in so many aspects of my life and I've shown you many of these videos that you could look back on. This piece is really, really close to my heart because I found the skirt among some stuff that my sister was gonna throw out or give away and the piece was definitely locally made or it was made by a local tailor somewhere and it's really really gorgeous it's a really great fabric the top is a piece I got from 
winners ages ago, about 16 or 17 years now. And guys, I love it. It's 100% cotton. Absolutely stunning. Anything with bows and anything where you mix texture and a softer fabric really makes you look elegant. So I love that. This is a recent addition to my wardrobe. I got this from a company called The Me and it's linen. It's absolutely stunning. This makes me look expensive. Here are some other pieces that are on the website that are absolutely stunning and could work for you if it's your style. Another way that you could look expensive and chic is to wear dupes. You guys know the dupe for this one. This is a beige dupe for the Balmain jacket and guys this piece absolutely looks expensive the fabric is definitely not desirable but it looks expensive you could also thrift for items that are looking expensive and they're everywhere they're, <laughs> there's there's no shortage of items that look expensive but are made from synthetic fibers so a good place to start is often your local thrift store or there are so many now that are online so yeah guys don't be fooled by the mantra that synthetic items do not look expensive they do because they are designed to fool you so therefore they do look expensive the Max Mara coat, dupes of it was everywhere and it was made from polyester but it looks expensive doesn't it so the best action is to actually thrift for synthetic items that look expensive that way you not only look expensive but you kill two birds with one stone you avoid the production of new synthetic items Yay! Tip number six is to invest in one visible item that you could wear every single day or every other day. Essentially, an item that you would get lots of wear out of. For me, it's belts. I love belts. I wear them every day. I wear them to events. So I do have a belt collection because they get their wearing but whatever it is that you absolutely love and would likely look expensive and make you look chic and absolutely fabulous definitely invest in it tip number seven wear items with contrasting buttons guys i can't stress enough how often I get complimented on pieces with lots of buttons especially contrasting ones be it black and white or tortoise or white guys I would show you a number of items that I often wear that just gets compliments and yes style cut fit matters but at the same time, I often get complimented whenever I wear items with buttons. Ooh, hey, hey. Hey, hey. Hey, hey. Hey, hey. 
good jeans, so a nigga tryna cuff me. All black at the white shows. White shoes, black shows. Green Tip number eight is to wear statement pieces. And guys, I don't care if you double, triple, quadruple them. Wear your statement pieces. Wear your style to the ground. Wear your pieces. Guys, whether you mix them with prints or solid colors, definitely go ham on your statement pieces. These would make you look expensive and chic. Take a look. This linen piece in particular just have a way of making me just look absolutely expensive and chic. So I love it. I wear it as often as I could. The only issue is that, well, two issues. It wrinkles easily and it gets dirty pretty easily. But this particular piece is one of my best looks ever and I just love it. So I kept showing it, so don't mind me. Enjoy. Tip number nine is to wear prints. Guys, go crazy with your prints. Do not ever conform to the narrative that prints are not stylish, that they're dated, be it bold or tiny prints. Well, oftentimes, by default, small prints are not considered to ever date, but bold prints are. But I would say to you that wear your prints with pride. If prints are your thing, definitely make them your timeless and wear them with pride they are absolutely elegant looking as well as they look expensive companies like dolce and gabbana and dior have been showcasing bold prints for decades so here are some other gorgeous prints that are in my closet that make me absolutely feel elegant sophisticated and in my opinion look very expensive And they are timeless. Another important tip is to wear items that drapes. Guys, this is one of four pieces in my closet, my quadruplets, and I absolutely love it. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you soon.